Welcome to the social media jungle, it's a scary world out there. Hey there fellow internet addicts, we all love a good scroll through social media, right? Sharing vacation pics, arguing about politics, it's the modern public square. But here's the thing, it's also a playground for hackers, scammers, and digital creeps. Think about it, your social media is a goldmine of personal info. Your birthday, your dog's name, where you went to school, all juicy tidbits for someone with bad intentions. And let's not even get started on those embarrassing party photos from 2008. That's why social media safety is more important than ever. We're talking about protecting your identity, your money, and your sanity. Because let's face it, dealing with a hacked account is about as fun as a root canal without anesthesia. So buckle up, Buttercup. We're about to dive into the wild world of social media security. Locking the front door, your social media security checklist. All right, folks, let's start with the basics. Think of your social media accounts like your house. You wouldn't leave your front door wide open with a sign that says free stuff inside, would you? First things first, strong passwords are key. And no, password 123 doesn't count. Get creative, use a mix of letters, numbers, and symbols. Better yet, use a password manager. It's like having a bodyguard for your logins. Next up, enable two-factor authentication, 2FA, on every account that offers it. It's like having a second lock on your door. Even if someone steals your keys, password, they still can't get in without that extra code. And speaking of security, be careful what you share online. Don't post your home address, your phone number, or your travel itinerary for the world to see. Remember, the internet is forever. Don't take the bait. Phishing and social engineering explained. Let's talk about phishing, the internet's version of a bait and switch. You know those emails claiming you won the lottery in Nigeria? Or the messages from your bank asking for your account details? Yeah, that's phishing. Hackers try to trick you into clicking on malicious links or giving up sensitive information. They often disguise themselves as legitimate sources like your bank, your email provider, or even your grandma. Then there's social engineering, the art of manipulating people into doing something stupid. Think of the Nigerian prince scam. That's classic social engineering. Hackers prey on your emotions, your trust, and sometimes your desperation to get rich quick. The best defense? Be skeptical. Don't click on suspicious links, don't give out personal information unless you're 100% sure of the source. And remember, if it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. The sneaky world of malware and password cracking. Malware is like the common cold of the internet. It's everywhere and it's annoying as hell. It's basically any software designed to harm your computer or steal your data. Think viruses, worms, trojans, all those nasty little programs that can wreak havoc on your digital life. You can get infected by clicking on a malicious link, downloading a shady file or even visiting a compromised website. And then there's password cracking, the brute force approach to hacking. Hackers use sophisticated software to guess your password by trying thousands of combinations per second. Not exactly subtle but surprisingly effective. The good news is strong passwords and up-to-date antivirus software can go a long way in protecting you from these threats. Think of it as boosting your immune system and wearing a hazmat suit in a digital petri dish. Section 5. Your data, their treasure data breaches, and session hijacking. Data breaches are the digital equivalent of someone breaking into your house and stealing all your stuff, except instead of your TV, they're after your personal information credit card details and maybe even your Netflix password. These breaches can happen to anyone, from individuals to giant corporations. Remember that time when, insert recent data breach from 2024? Yeah, not great. Then there's session hijacking where hackers basically steal your online identity. Imagine someone logging into your bank account and draining it dry while you're busy watching cat videos. Not cool, right? This usually happens when you're connected to public Wi-Fi networks which are about as secure as a screen door on a submarine. So next time you're at Starbucks, think twice before doing your online banking. Section 6. The Trojan Horse Third-Party Apps and SIM Swapping Dangers We all love those convenient third-party apps that let us log in with our social media accounts, right? No need to remember another password, right? Well, not so fast. These apps often have access to a scary amount of your personal data. And if they get hacked, which happens more often than you think, your information could be up for grabs. Then there's SIM swapping, a terrifyingly effective tactic where hackers convince your mobile provider to switch your phone number to their SIM card. 
Once they have your number, they can bypass two-factor authentication and gain access to your accounts. The takeaway? Be careful about which apps you give access to your social media accounts, and be wary of any suspicious activity on your phone, like calls from your mobile provider that you didn't initiate. Section 7. Outsmart the Hackers Practical Tips for Social Media Safety Okay, enough with the scary stuff. Let's talk about how to protect yourself from these digital delinquents. Here are a few practical tips to keep in mind. Be choosy with your friends. Only accept friend requests from people you actually know. Random hot singles in your area probably aren't who they claim to be. Think before you click. Don't click on links from unknown senders or suspicious-looking websites. It's like playing Russian roulette with your computer. Lock down your privacy settings. Adjust your social media privacy settings to control who can see your posts, your photos, and your personal information. Be wary of public Wi-Fi. Avoid accessing sensitive information like your bank account on public Wi-Fi networks. They're like a hacker's dream come true. Keep your software updated. Install the latest software updates for your operating system, web browser, and antivirus program. It's like giving your digital immune system a booster shot. Section 8 2024's Biggest Hits and Misses Social Media Hacks You Should Know Remember that time when insert a recent social media hack from 2024? Yeah, that was a mess. Cybersecurity is like a constantly evolving arms race and 2024 has seen its fair share of high-profile hacks. From social media giants to online retailers, no one is immune to the threat. These incidents serve as a stark reminder that even the most sophisticated security measures can be breached. So, what can we learn? from these digital disasters. Well, for starters, it highlights the importance of staying informed about the latest cybersecurity threats. Knowledge is power, people. Section 9, Fighting Fire with Fire, How Technology is Beefing Up Security. It's not all doom and gloom, folks. The good news is that technology is also being used to enhance security and combat cybercrime. Think of it as the digital equivalent of building a bigger, badder wall Artificial intelligence AI, is playing an increasingly important role in detecting and preventing cyber attacks. These AI-powered systems can analyze massive amounts of data to identify suspicious patterns and flag potential threats. Biometric authentication such as fingerprint scanning and facial recognition is also becoming more commonplace. While not foolproof, these technologies add an extra layer of security by making it more difficult for hackers to impersonate you. And let's not forget about the unsung heroes of cybersecurity, the ethical hackers who use their skills to identify vulnerabilities and help organizations improve their security posture. They're like the digital equivalent of the A-team, but with less face paint. Section 10. Stay safe out there, folks. A final word on social media security. So, there you have it, folks. The wild, wacky, and sometimes downright terrifying world of social media security. It's a jungle out there, but by following these tips, you can navigate the digital landscape safely and responsibly. Remember, cybersecurity is a shared responsibility. We all have a role to play in protecting ourselves and each other from online threats. So, be vigilant, be informed, and most importantly, be safe out there. And if you ever find yourself the victim of a cyber attack, don't panic. There are resources available to help you recover and protect yourself from future threats. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go change all my passwords and invest in a Faraday cage for my phone, just kidding, or am I?